What's up guys, this is Dr. Light here, and I'm bringing you to episode 2 of this this troublesome 30% boosted Pokemon Platinum Nuzlocke. And in the last episode, I started this thing out, and it has gone pretty well. And if you guys haven't seen it, you better check back on that Sunday episode, because it was kind of wild, honestly, though. But you guys are here now, so I'm going to be showing you this team we made in that first episode. So... First of all, we have a Monk the Giraffe Rig with that amazing Giraffe ability with Confusion, Stomp, Astonish, and Odor Slew. You guys may notice that it raised Monk one level up to level 10 and now has Stomp, which is pretty awesome. And then we have our Thick Fat Torterra, level 11 with Razor Leaf, Absorb, Tackle, and Withdraw. And he was our starter, just in case you guys didn't know because you didn't check out that last episode, which you should. I'm pretty sure, though, uh, Don told us about going to this trainer school, so I'm going to check that out. No, no, no. Actually, let me check something real quick. Uh, our money's still really low. I can only get, like, three Pokeballs. So I'm going to do this, and I got a spooky plate. Actually, I'm going to give that to Giraffe Rig just in case I need that Astonish. Uh, somewhere here. It's the next one. Oh, and I picked up a power band. It was on the uh, route to the down. What does power band do? Promotes special defense, but reduces speed. That sounds like a money seller. So maybe I should. No. Okay. So I'm pretty sure what you're supposed to do is fight these two kids. I'm pretty sure. So we are going to speed this up a little bit. You know what? While we're early on. Uh, all right, cool. It's just totally fine. Um, schedule for this Sunday, Wednesday. If you guys didn't know, it's considering I already said the last one's on Sunday and that today is Wednesday. If you guys didn't pick that up, interesting. That did not do as much as I thought it would. Lit. All right, so both of our mon can fight for themselves now. So that's actually really nice. Uh, I got this. I got this. There we go. I want Torterra to get this experience. And, um, if anyone... Ooh, what a switch. If anyone does know, uh, where the name raider is, please tell me. I really have no clue. I don't... I don't know this game. Do these kids give me anything? Hold on. I feel like I'm, that's literally going to become a catchphrase for me, is hold on. Because I say it so often. Oh, I got a town map. That's actually super sweet. Uh, yeah, that's what I thought. This guy's looking for me. Because it's 30% boosted, I'm so unfocused on the story that... I just want to be able to beat the game. That's what matters to me. And I don't know this game well enough to know, like, what items I should pick up or where they are. So if you guys feel like helping me, please do leave, leave stuff in the comments. I could use the help. I only pick 30% boosted because normal Nuzlocks are just, they're, they're not, they're not, um, challenging enough most of the time. That's why if you guys don't know, uh, on Mondays and Tuesdays, I do a live series um, I'm getting coupons from clowns. Um, a live series called the Ruby and Sapphire um, Solo Soul Link One Controller Challenge. It's pretty self-explanatory whenever I say it like that. I'm going to slow it down a little bit. I don't really care about heal balls. Um, I've got four. I'm going to round it out with one more. And we're going to buy 10 Pokeballs. And we're going to go back and get that encounter in the lakefront. Because I feel like I'm going to need encounters in this block. So I'm just going to rush on back, speed up style. Which should take me all of like three seconds. I should have jumped down, but that's fine. Uh, I'm actually thinking I'm going to have Giraffe Rig lead this party. 
because he's got the Astonish, even though it's Spooky Plate boosted, it's still just Astonish. All right, Lake Variety or Verity, I don't. Oh boy, I'm gonna switch out into Torterra just in case it explodes. Okay, so now we know we don't get that encounter, and that's fine. At least we know now. And I'm betting there was something super awesome there, but I'm not going to think about it. I'm thinking about it. Alright, so we're going to heal. And I guess I'm going to finish whatever's in the next city. I think it was called Jubilife. I know that's a city in 4th gen, I just don't know where it is or if I have the right city. Wait, that looks like a hidden item spot. Insect plate, sweet. I know it looks like I know this game really well, but I think it's just because I've played it um, to a point before, but nowhere near the end of the game. Oh, look, a clown. Isn't there like three or four of these clowns you have to find somewhere in like one's like in an alleyway or something okay here's another one okay there's two so is that is that all of them or is there more this looks like a spot for a hidden item on one of these sides hang on 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 nope uh Oh, right, I think you can get the old rod somewhere. No, I think it's to the left here. Actually, I think you get... Yeah, you get the old rod from that guy. You get it so early on in this game. Ooh. That'd be awesome with Torterra. Um... Let me see if I have this right. Yes, I do. Sweet. You know, I'm noticing that the gameplay top screen looks a little bit pixelated. I'll see if I can fix that for the next episode. But I have literally no idea how to mess with it. Okay, we got an encounter. It's a... Ooh, it's a Neato Queen. That's sick. Get that Astonish. Hit it again. Hit it again. Yes. I'm always worried about that last one being a crit every time. Okay, that's fine. Okay, we're poisoned. That's not fine. Torterra's got this, though. We got this Nido Queen. We got this Nido Queen. Come on, Needle Queen. I literally can't do anything else to you. Thank you. All right. Nickname time. I got my random word gen generator out here. Let's see. Okay. It. Um. It. It literally made is, and I don't. I don't really want that to be a name. There we go. That's a good name. Ghost Writer. Not not writer, but writer. Uh, I don't know if it's going to fit completely, so I might have to, like, put it together, but we'll see. Uh, no, it won't. So, what I'll do is, is I will do the capitalization again, and do it like this. No? Yeah, that's fine. It's close enough. All right, so let's check out what Ghost Rider has got going for her. She's got Stench. Okay, that's not bad. Pretty good moveset. Uh, you're not going to lead. Oh, the poison does hurt you. No, poison goes away in 4th gen, so it's fine. Man, I hope I'm right. Yes, okay, we're fine. Oh, right, I have to timestamp um, the Nido Queen uh, Ghost Rider. 
writer. That's gonna be so. I'm thinking. I'm, I'm, I'm basically just gonna say Ghost Rider like this whole time, and it, it's fine. Uh, there's another clown I need to find. Are they like in a building? Oh, there's an item. No oh, choice specs. Choice scarf and choice specs. That's amazing. If I can get the right Pokemon for this, it's gonna be amazing. I mean, I already have Girafferig. Girafferig's already pretty good. Uh, especially if I just want to use, like, uh, Confusion. But I, I really don't like being stuck into one move most of the time. Okay, so not there. I assume this clown's around here somewhere. Uh, or maybe I only needed three. I don't really want to go that way because I don't want to deal with Looker yet. So maybe I'll go and get my encounter here. That's... Ooh. I don't even know how many balls I have, though. 13, I'm fine, right? It's a Trico. Grass starters unite. Come on, I already got Torterra. I already have a Torterra. You're mine. You are mine. Dang it, Gex getting the ball. Okay, I don't like my, how far my defense is lowered. I'm catching this thing right now. Come on. Come on. Yes! Sick. All right. Another word generator. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Let's get it. This is going to be Party the Trico. What a great name. Only if I could spell. Have an awesome ability. That's the first one I have that I've caught that isn't fully evolved, too. Quick feet. Okay, that's not bad. He's probably going to chill in the back of the party because he isn't fully evolved, and I'm worried that he'll get hurt. I'm a concerned parent. Trico is 100% my parent. No, wait. First of all, timestamp that Trico. I meant it. I meant I am 100% Trico's parent. People don't give you items in Pokemon Centers anymore, and I'm sad. Is this the one I need to talk to? No. Um, I think I'm going to go up here and I'm going to fight this trainer. No. I'm going to go do Looker's thing. Wait, what? Oh, 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 oh. This is what... Okay, I'm supposed to talk to this guy about the clowns. Okay. And now I can go this way. This is a rival battle, isn't it? He has a Latios. Lit. Oh, right. Latios sucks. It just has Psywave. Porygon Z. I think it's just going to have, like, Tackle, basically. Oh, it's got a nasty plot. Thank you, Torterra. And thank you for starter experience growth, because he did gain two levels from that Porygon Z. Alright, so uh, I think I'm going to fight the trainer up top here. I know I'm basically playing this... I Actually, yeah, I'm playing too fast on this game. I think I just need to slow it down. So... I'm doing pretty well with the game right now. Like, there's nothing really going wrong. Okay, I can fight a Shuckle. I've got Confusion. I hope I pick up like a Fire type soon. Really take advantage of that Drought. That's fine. It's a four hit KO, that's fine. I really want to speed this up because like nothing's really happening in it. But I don't want to just speed up through this whole game, you know? I think I just need to slow it down, you know? 
This is meant to be kind of like a calm series. Like, I'm not trying to be high stakes. It's only high stakes whenever I'm going to lose, which is probably going to be fairly common in this game. You get an itchy nose sometimes. Do you guys get that? I need a question of the day for today. Um. Oh, I know. Um, I brought this up in, um... Mm, no, wait. Yeah, I'll go, I'll go and say. I brought this up in a co-op episode with, um, Killer Darkrai. Uh, plug. Anyways. Um. Who is your celebrity crush? I'm gonna timestamp that so I know that that's the question that I asked. Also, um, there's something new that I'm gonna try with this series. I don't know if you guys noticed. But I'm gonna do recaps uh, on the last episode at the beginning of the episode rather than doing intro moments. So let me know how you guys feel about that. That's not the question of the day, but um, still, let me know how you feel, you know? I'm just trying something out. I'm probably gonna try to do more uh, mid-edits as well. Uh, like, for example, uh, I'll do one right now. Uh, my celebrity crush, um, according to what I discussed in uh, co-op, is uh, Emma Watson. Because um, she is like the only one, the only actress I can think of that um, I feel more attracted to the person than the character that they play. Which, I mean, if you guys want to say like the character that you're attracted to, that's fine. You can say that. Because, like, I don't... I'm not really attracted to her in, like, Harry Potter sense. It's more of the other films that she has done with her career. I think she is more attractive in. I mean, first of all, because she is older. But, um... Kingler would have been cool. Would have done more type diversity. Um... But... I think, like, Beauty and the Beast she was really good in. Um... I know I've seen her in other stuff, too. I just can't think of it. Um, this is an encounter up here. Uh, nope. Nope. Nothing coming to mind. So, hang on. I'm gonna, I'm gonna look up Emma Watson real quick and see what she's been in while I'm battling this Pichu. That does really matter. Um... Emma Watson, what has she been in? I'm gonna look at her IMDb. There's a video playing on it for some reason. So I'm gonna skip it? I. Why am I watching a video at all? Um, Perks of being a wallflower, That I know that has like really high praise. Uh, the, the bling ring? I have no idea what that is. Oh, she did Little Women. W woman. Little Woman. That's right. Um, she was in The Circle. What's another thing I know her for, though? I know her for This Is The End. She was funny in that. Uh, hang on, I'm waiting for this guy to walk in front of me. Um, what else? Most of the rest of her, like, major stuff is, um, Harry Potter. At least from what I know. I think a lot of the other stuff is more, like, indie. But that's, I mean, that's fine, you know? She's pretty much hit, hit her success already, you know? So let me know who your guys' celebrity crush is in the comments below. Oh, I, he, he's in battle me. Okay, that's fine. Uh, how am I doing? I mean, I'm, I'm fine on that front, but I think I need Pokeballs. Yeah, before I get that encounter, I definitely need to get Pokeballs. Okay. I'm very glad that wasn't my encounter. So I'm going to go back and heal real quick. And then I'm going to go battle a few more trainers on the right side before I get encounters uh, in any more places. Because I want to make sure I have the Pokeballs and money to do that. 
Yep. Yep. Battle you. Battle you. Battle you. Battle all of you. Um. I mean, I guess, yeah, just go for the stomp. Ghastly? I mean, sure, you know. Throw it out there. Monk's kind of crazy, honestly. <laughs> Uh, I don't necessarily want to throw my other members up front right now, because I'm kind of worried about, um, you know, I'm going to go and do it. Uh, but I am kind of worried about Shadow Tag, so I'm not going to put Party up in front, especially. That's a Glaceon. That's where it's good to have Thick Fat on my, gosh, diggity darn, um, Torterra. Oh my goodness, that was three levels. No, I don't really care about agility. Okay, okay. What's up, bud? Bronzor? Um, no. Actually, I still don't really have anyone that can fight a Bronzor. Like, the best I have is using, like, Astonish. Yeah, I didn't figure Bronzor could really touch my, uh, monk really well. Yeah, I'm doing a lot more damage than it is to me. Alright, already level 9 with Ghost Rider. Sweet. Oh, Hopip. You can fight a Hopip. Oh, yeah, there we go. You can't fight a Dug Trio. But you can definitely get the experience for fighting a Dug Trio. Raticate? You can fight a Raticate. You also can fight a Chikorita. I feel like I'm slightly overleveled, but I'm not. Not really. I'm just gonna keep getting these grinds up, you know? Um, the only thing you can be hit with from my Ghost Rider is Poison Sting, and that was not gonna go well. Nope, 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 nope. Oh, this is a new route. I'm, I was being... Did I run from my encounter? I feel like I ran from my encounter, but I'm gonna... I'm gonna... I'm gonna go buy Pokeballs real quick, and then I'm gonna come back, and I'm gonna encounter something. And if it's something that I feel like I've already seen, and I know it, then I'm gonna probably just uh, run from it. But uh, I'll probably check back on the recording, and I'll know... But if you guys want to, you can let me know in the comments. Alright, we're just going to pick up 10 again. Nice. I'm, I'm doing the speed up thing again. I'm sorry, guys. Like, I just... It, it's a trigger thing. It, it's like just trigger finger, you know? I really feel like I just ran past her and didn't get an, an encounter. Another plate, wow. Okay, let me see what I get. Kecleon. I definitely did not encounter a Kecleon before. It has anticipation. Okay. Um... Uh, I'm gonna throw a few balls at this, but a Kecleon's not gonna help me a whole lot. Oh. Okay. Um, so I guess I'm gonna kind of look around in the grass for a second here and see if... Okay, that's a fairly fitting name. His name is going to be, uh, Morale. More... Ow. I could use some more morale. If any cheerleaders want to come by and like, give me some morale, I'd be... Ooh, that's a free static encounter. Alright. I forgot I have stench. Actually, I might not have actually encountered anything because of stench. Okay, definitely encountered Doduo. This is good. So stench might have actually saved me. Um, I definitely didn't encounter Kabuto either. Let me just check one more encounter. Okay. Yeah, I don't think I actually encountered anything. What does morale even have? I know you have anticipation. 
Okay. I mean, he's he's kind of a backup mon. Uh, there's no reason I can't move forward right now. Like, I'm doing pretty good. Just kind of... And I don't really know what the right way to go is, but I'm pretty sure he gives me something, right? You give me... HM06, which is Rock Smash. But I need the Orberg Gym Badge. Okay, I can't go that way. Okay, I got my encounter. It's A. Okay, that's Species. I don't necessarily want to call Species on it. Oh, I forgot to add Kecleon. Don't mind if he was added late. I don't really care that much about Kecleon. Sounds harsh, but it's just true. Okay. Um, there should be an easy battle. Another mod with anticipation. It's really interesting not having poison point on a Nido Queen. Like that's just what I know them for, basically. I'm always hesitant to hit them with a physical move just for that reason. Okay, goes right as level 12. Why not? It doesn't have the moves yet of Boba Fett, because it's going to get them to level 15. I know things, guys. Okay. I do want to be able to still get the encounter in this episode, because I want to try to keep it right around 30 minutes. I'd really dig an amulet coin right now. Yes, I'm fighting these people on purpose. Just in case that was not clear. Torterra, get out here. Razor Leaf, still gonna do half. Or one shot, that's cool too, jeez. Okay. Uh, what's my money? Thousand, I probably should have saved my money, honestly. 13 balls. I know I've got stench, so it's gonna be harder. Okay, there has to be another encounter in here. Hang on. Lit. Hariyama's great. I will definitely take Hariyama. I resist. Yeah, I resist. That's fine. Scratch it again. All right. I'm not too worried about catching this thing either. Um, lit. Bro, we're having a good time. Timestamp Hariyama. Generate new word? I'm sure, you know. This boy's nickname is going to be... Well, I, I saw the word already. Um... It re-randomized or redid another word, and I'm not gonna spell this, so I'm gonna change it to the word it redid it to. So this is gonna be going to be bottle. There we go. Bottle for the win. Uh does bottle have anything going for him? Ooh, he's got a hyper cutter, that's awesome. And he's going to be the new one we start training up now. Uh, party getting back. Ghost Rider's powerful enough to take care of herself, and you are not. Because um, it only took one ball. I'm actually going to go back to that other cave that I kind of bailed on, and I'm just going to get an encounter there as well. And then I think that's going to be a pretty solid episode, you know? All right, I have a full team of six. So actually, if I get something better, I might be able to sub out like that Kecleon. Oh, is this the Regirock? Nope, there's another legendary there. Uh, I actually don't want Hariyama to lead with that. So, let me go ahead and get this encounter here. Lepaberry, not bad. So I know I have Stench, so... So I encountered a shaman. Does this boy have fake out? No, but he does have a lick. 
And I know for a fact Shaman only has growth right now, actually. So actually, this is going to be super good. I can just keep licking it until I paralyze it. Yes! Okay. I go for the one more lick. Get in the red. Oh, oh boy. I'm going to let this be slow and steady and watch us win this race. Am I right, though? Bro. Bro. Oh. Playing with my heart. Okay. 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 Oh my gosh. Bro, we're catching the shaman. Come on. No, 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 no. You, you can't do triple jiggle first time and then not get in the ball. That's not how this works. No, no, no. Mm -mm. You are literally the perfect legendary to encounter. Oh, come on, Shaman. Come on. Just give me that triple jiggle. Give it to me. Come on. Shaman. Shaman. I need you to get in the ball. I I can really see me needing your your amazing amount of power in this Nuzlocke. Okay. What a game! What a game! Oh my... My word, my words are just gone. What, what am I naming this shaman? No, I need, I need a good name. No, there we go. That's a good name. This shaman will henceforth be known as Horizon. Oh my gosh, I just caught a shaman. I don't even care if I have three grass types. Bro, let me go look at this shaman. I'm so glad I waited to get that encounter. Uh, nope. Hang on, I want the move. And that's going to be a timestamp because... Uh, morale is definitely going to be put in the box right now. Alright, let's check out Horizon. Horizon has an item as well. Chest ovary, sweet. And Horizon has the ability Snow Cloak. Which might mean that it doesn't get hurt by hailstorms. I'm never sure about that. And it does only have growth, like I said. So we're going to be taking that berry from it. And, um... You know, I think I'm going to go ahead and get through the cave because I'm basically already through it. There's no reason to make you guys just wait on that. That's dumb. I'm super glad I didn't encounter Deoxys. Yeah. And then I'm in Orb. There was literally no reason for me to not go ahead and do this. Okay, he's taking me to the gym. That's fine. Take me to the gym. All right, and this right here is where we're going to leave off. So I'm going to go ahead and save as well. And uh, for the next episode, I'm going to go ahead and grind up the team roughly to like 15. And I think I should be good to fight, um, I think it's Rourke, the first gem leader. So if you guys want to catch that next week, it's going to be dropping on Sunday, hopefully right around 3 p.m. Eastern Central. That's where I like when I like to drop all of my videos. So... Um, if you guys want to see what happens with this uh, literally crazy start in these first two episodes, please come back on Sunday. Check out what happens. Later.